Ibrahim Traore, you have an amazing team. Wow, it is finally happened. Dr. Likana Chumbori Kwao and ADDI delegation uh, meet with the president of Burkina Faso in Ouagadougou. Uh, and this is what Dr. Likana Chumbori Kwao uh, said. I would like to say thank you so much to the great and wonderful people of Burkina Faso. We are here to uh, show our support to the great nation, the great republic of Burkina Faso for the work that you all have done, the suffering that you have been through to fight for your freedom. That you have done, and I would like to say, on behalf of the African diaspora from all over the world, congratulations for the job well done. Congratulations for the mission having been accomplished. So we are here because we have been working with your amazing embassy in Washington, D.C. I must start by wanting to thank them for the work that they have done. Honestly, if I may address President Ibrahim Traore, you have an amazing team in Washington, D.C. Yes. Burkina Faso is well represented. I must honestly start by saying, many of us were being called and being cautioned, are you sure you want to go to Burkina Faso? <laughs> and I can tell you, the more they called us, the more they warned us about going against going to Burkina Faso, the more determined we were to come to Burkina Faso. Because what other country in Africa has done, what, what has been done in Burkina Faso, what has been done in Niger, what has been done in Mali. This is the new Africa. This is the revolution Africa has needed. And you guys have picked up where Thomas Sankara left. Yes. And you are showing us the way. Why on earth would we not come? to support you. We want you to know that we feel you, that we hear you. We are here to support you, and we are all in, fired up and ready to go. Investment, yes, ma'am. Entrepreneurship, yes, ma'am. You name it, we are here to join hands with you to build the Burkina, Burkina Faso we want, to build the Africa that we want. That's our mission, and that's why we're here. Yes, this is fantastic. I'm happy that uh, the dreams come true. Uh, we have been preaching that we want to see uh, Dr. Rikana Chombori Kwao, Professor Pierre Lumumba, Joshua Maponga, Julius Malema to come together to send the clear message together to the people of Africa in the continent, in the diaspora, and those who are in the Caribbean about uh, Africa. And I'm happy that Dr. Rikana Chombori Kwao speak. Uh, direct to uh, the president of Burkina Faso, Captain Ibrahim Traoré, and Captain Ibrahim Traoré also um, shared his views to Dr. Alkana Chombol Kwao. We want to see uh, people like Dr. Alkana Chombol Kwao, uh, Professor Pierre Mumba, Julius Malema, uh, these young leaders in the Sahel regions and the uh, uh, the header one seven. We want to see that Africans will come together. We need to use these uh, knowledges and this intelligence from these people to unite the people of Africa. If we are serious uh, people of Africa, we can come together. I'm happy that is happening. So uh, we want to see maybe one day to have a meeting uh, with Dr. Ikana Chombori Kwao, Captain Ibrahim, Asimi Goita of Mali fire of Senegal, um, uh, Abraman Chiani of Niger, uh, we want to see also Julius Malema, Joshua Maponga, um, President Museveni, Kagame, Samia Suluasan, Kenya, I mean Luto, um, and all Afghan leaders, they should come together and sit down and plan for the future of this continent. We need to have to spend almost even one week to create the plan for the future of this continent. So kings and queens, this is a good news and this is wonderful to see that uh, the HDDI Af African Diaspora uh, Development Institute under the leadership of uh, Madame uh, Ambassador Dr. Alkana Chombol Kwao met with one of the revolutionary leaders of Burkina Faso uh, Captain Ibrahim Traore. I, 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 I guess also uh, maybe the ADDI will go to Mali uh, to meet with uh, 
Asimi Goita also they will go to Niger to meet Abraham and Chan. We want to see the awakening of Africans. We need to see um, ADDI under the leadership of Dr. Alkana Chomboy Kwao to call African leaders, to share knowledge with African leaders on how we can liberate Africa uh, economically. We want to own our resources, we want to create jobs in the continent of Africa. And as you heard from Dr. Alikana Chombol Kwao, sometimes people in the diaspora, people in the Caribbean have been told different stories about the continent of Africa. Sometimes they've been told, no, don't go to Africa, don't go and invest in Africa. Africa is a continent that has a lot of conflict, you can't uh, get profit. But just to see how other civilizations are coming to Africa. Russians are here, Chinese are here, Japanese are here, Koreans are here, Americans are here, Europeans are here, all are here. Why? Because Africa is a place where you can invest and make a lot of money. So Africa is a continent where there is a lot of opportunities. Resources are here, human capital are here. So it is our duty as the people of Africa to come together to invest in our resources. Um, I will continue to preach peace in this continent and the unity in this continent. If we can come together like this, we can share uh, our views, our thoughts on how we can do our things, how we can plan for our future, Africa we can move forward. Kings and Queens, this is what happened in Burkina Faso, Ouagadougou, where uh, Dr. Kana Chombol Kwao and um, Captain Ibrahim Traore shared some views and opinions. So they have exchanged their views way forward. I'm happy. And this is what we want to see in the continent of Africa. We are waiting to see uh, Professor Pierre Mumba in Ouagadouk, in uh, Bamako in Mali, in Yemen, in, in Niger, uh, in Dakar, in Senegal. We want these people good people in Africa like the Pan-Africanist to move around this continent to preach a uh, unit in this continent way forward what can we do as the people of Africa we need all of us to come together of course this is the journey of not the fainted yet but we need uh, to move together as the people of Africa so uh, this is uh, fantastic and this is a good move and also I would like to hear from you, kings and queens, what is your opinion for this? Um, uh, what can we do to bring all the people of Africa together? Uh, we want Africa to build, um, African to build our continent. So it is possible, it is possible if we collaborate with the people in the diaspora, people in the Caribbean. We have good people in that places. We have doctors uh, in the diaspora in Europe, Everywhere we have Africans who can come back to the continent, investing in this continent, and we can start developing our continent. We need Africans who have uh, who can help us to bring peace in this continent in some areas. Of course, we have some conflict in some areas. We need people who we can bring all of us together, negotiate with one another. We want to stop war in uh, Sudan. We want to stop war in uh, Congo. So it doesn't mean that we Africa, we want conflicts. No, sometimes it is because we are so divided. So it is very easy to be manipulated. So kings and queens, this is the time for the people of Africa, for the continent of Africa to come together, to unite. And uh, I'm happy that Dr. Kana Chombol Kwao has done uh, a great job, a great work to make sure that uh, he meet with the president of Burkina Faso, the young leader, Captain Ibrahim Traoré. I'm waiting to see, as I said, uh, Professor Pierre Mumba also. So, kings and queens, uh, that is what is happening in Ouagadougou, um, Burkina Faso. Those are just updates. The full video is coming. Wait for it. Thank you.